Right, here we are on the start of another one of their little adventures, standing underneath the Sydney Harbour Bridge. We've just come into Luna Park, which is, I don't know, I'll pan round slowly, just down that footpath there. Luna Park is there. So, we're heading up over the bridge on the footpath there to get a view. We've got the rocks over there in the distance. That's Sydney Opera House. Uh, we're just about to head off up here. It's quite a jaunt up this street. It's quite a, quite a steep hill, but yeah, we're on our way up to the station. We'll catch it later. Right, well here we are. We managed to get up the this is our second trip up a set of stairs that are just down there. We went the other side, but that's for cycles only. So here we are, we're on Sydney Harbour Bridge and we've not seen this side before. There's a lovely old church over there, various calves. One got my eye with the chocolate sign there. But yeah, it's all good. Right, well, we'll start our walk then. Catch you in a bit. So here we are. The bridge and we're going over the water now Jeff. This is when I'm going to get scared. And there we are, we've got a uh, nice set of houses there, a lovely rooftop garden and there's an e even an emu in the garden if I can get it in there it is. I love those houses. Here we go, we're still we're getting ever closer to the actual going over the water. Not too many people, I'd say, have uh, posted this viewpoint. sure what that building is down there. It's very wobbly. So, we're going to climb right up to the top of that tower. But, um, okay, we're not. I believe there's a lift there, but we'll wait and see, eh? So, we're going to go up there and um, get a perfect view. Yet, but it's really busy. 
yeah, I've got me too, the little down ramp. trains and the cars and the pedestrians and the other side the cyclists all going over. Be nice to catch a plane flying over the top as well. Whoops. Lost me grip. Ha. Someone said I did that a long time ago. I'll find out where the gang is. They're not far behind. This is much easier than the pocket bump. Yeah. I am doing the whole walk, so as such. Oh, there's access. Oh, there's where you walk up the bridge. See the steps there? Yeah. So there's the steps running up there and all the way up. So we're not that much further off. Oh no, that's the lower span, sorry. That's not the actual top span. The top span stairway takes you right up there. This is just the lower span. Just for... Yeah, I've got that now. My mistake. And now we're out over the water. Day today. We've had some rain, but it's turned out fine for us. Plenty of boating activity. Wow. This guy's car. That was the U, not the U, the um, SUV. Thank you. 
Sydney ferries. Pulling out. And of course, we're even closer to the Opera House. Looks like we might have some rain coming, looking over there. They've had some this morning here, but we missed it. dollars a pop hmm uh, I'll take the cheap route this one we're on free nice shot Where's the lift, Jeff? Not here. Obviously. Oh. And it looks like a But we was told there's a lift. There must be another one somewhere. A ticketing museum and cinema. Well, that was a disappointment. We were going to go up there. But they want $30 each to go up there and you've got to walk up. There's no, there's no lift. We were under the impression after a video we saw that there was a lift that took us up to one of those towers, but there's not. So hey ho, we might as well just go to the Sky Tower. It's beautiful down there. That's where we went for our dinner that the boys treated us to. Right down there, all beautiful. This is, I do love Sydney. Don't like all the people and the hush, hustle and bustle, but I do love the buildings, the city itself. It's fantastic. It is a truly amazing city. I suppose if I lived and worked in the city, it wouldn't be so bad. I love all the ferries, the trains, and everything, the ease of access to everything. As long as. As long as you've. Um, yeah, you can get on these things. Sydney Cafe Society here. Oops, I'm just going to go over the spars of the bridge. Just look at that. Fantastic.
Right, and we've come virtually to the end of the bridge near enough now. Here's the Star Casino over there. Not been there yet. Not a big casino person myself, but I do like going just to, but not to gamble. I enjoy the atmosphere and I could go on the pokies. <laughs> That's about my limit. Mr. Adventure. Put me out in the bush instead. Happier there. This is actually the end and the steps down are just up there. There is an elevator. This is the only elevator and one on the other end but it only takes you down. It doesn't take you way up to the top like um, some Instagram post tells people. So if you want to go up to the top of the harbour bridge it costs $29 and you've got to work, walk up over 200 steps so uh, we didn't do it because we've got other things we've got to do but the elevator is free but it takes you down to the bottom and brings you up to this level so just to put people right on there if you see the Instagram post it's not true right here we are in the rocks. Jeff's getting hangry. He's not eaten, eaten since last night, and I didn't eat a lot last night. So. I'm trying to find somewhere to eat, but it hasn't got massive queues. Very nice. It's New Year's Eve on this day. <laughs> Looking across to here, seeing all people getting turfed off the steps because they didn't want them sitting on the steps. And this was our view of the fireworks. If you want some great market and see some great stuff, head to the rocks for sure. Fantastic place, but make sure you have plenty of time to fit it all in and that's the bridge we walked over didn't we do well uh... it's like we're in another world isn't it another country yeah, it it's like we've stepped back oh. harbour rocks hotel Oh, that's like Cotswolds, Jeff. Those there. To what I remember, anyway. Well, I do believe there's a market going on there too, Jeff. Oh, yeah. Bar, restaurants. Oh, no, don't give them a ticket. Very nice. The wine shop. No, don't touch it. Bed and breakfast on the rocks. Ooh. These little houses. Aren't they cute, Jeff? Really old 
old. They're so old, hey. They've got metal plates on the doors. Yeah, that was to keep the um, deck man coming. <laughs> Is that a meter box, do you think? I'm just showing I'm not that old. <laughs> Beautiful. Let's go in, Jeff. Can you guys give me information on the tours that we have? Okay, thank you. Oh God, I remember these scales. <laughs> I've actually used to have one of those with big tins. Do you remember that, Brendan? Mm -hmm. Right, the Swiss bits. Bitter bits. This reminds me of that country museum. With the, you can stand and watch them make these sugary sweets at the Black Country Museum. Oh yeah, they make them in the shop, don't they? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Put them in a doodle. Oh, I do. Oh, I see drops, Jeff. <laughs> Humbugs. <gasps> oh, raspberry drops. The, those I used to put in my um, skirt pocket at school and just have them in class, but not to tell people. I'm not that old yet. It's a real old fashioned soap. Sunlight? Yeah, I did. I did. Thank you very much, love. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I think we've got it pretty known where we live in, hey, Thank to you. these days. We have come a long way. We have come a long way. Yeah, it's like 1923s. <laughs> Does it remind you of Worcester? My nuns. on Playfair Street. Or cheese scones. So this is the menu. Oh, looks very nice. We were up there looking down 
at obviously the Sydney Opera House and this area here which is where we were treated to a magnificent dinner by b and It's called Six Head for some reason. Somebody's got an engagement party on there. Brittany and Chris must have some money, that's for sure. <laughs> Gee whiz. It's very beautiful down here though. I'll get over me hungry. Oops. Probably Brittany and Chris arriving for an engagement party. In for lunch, not here, just further up. We went to the James Squires Bar, which is just up there. Very nice pulled pork burger, that was beautiful. And now we're heading back down to the ferry down here to catch it back to Luna Park, and then we'll have a coffee there and then we'll take the drive back. Here we are on the ferry, waiting to go across to Luna Park. We are on the back of the boat, or the stern, as us captains like to call it. I don't say that because I've got my boat license. In Queensland. God's country. over and we caught the ferry back. 